Surendrajit Singh Aluwalia born the 4th of July 1951 is an Indian politician of the Bharatiya Janata Party BJP and is its national vice president a union minister of state in the government of India he is the member of parliament of India representing Darjeeling Lok Sabha constituency in West Bengal in the 16th Lok Sabha Previously he was a member of parliament representing Bihar and Jharkhand in the Rajya Sabha, the upper house of the Indian parliament, over several terms, 1986–1992, 1992–1998, 2000–2006, and 2006–2012. He was earlier a member of the Indian National Congress. He was elected into the parliament as an MP from Bihar, in 1986. Over the years of his career, he has held the posts of Minister for Urban Development, and Minister of Parliamentary Affairs in the Union Government headed by P. V. Narasimha Rao. He was Deputy Leader of the Opposition in the Rajya Sabha, till 2012 when he lost his Rajya Sabha seat in the Jharkhand Rajya Sabha elections. He subsequently entered the Lok Sabha, winning the 2014 Lok Sabha elections from Darjeeling. He is at present a member of the National Executive Committee of the BJP. Career Aluwalia is a lawyer by education. Political career Aluwalia was a member of parliament from Rajya Sabha representing Bihar and Jharkhand in 1986–1992, 1992–1998, 2000–2006, 2006–2012. He was elected to the Lok Sabha from the Darjeeling parliamentary constituency of West Bengal with active support of a local unrecognized party Gorkha Janmukti Morcha in May 2014. He served as Minister of State for Urban Affairs and Employment, Department of Urban Employment and Poverty Alleviation and Parliamentary Affairs in PV Narasimha Rao cabinet from the 15th of September 1995 to the 16th of May 1996. He was deputy leader of the opposition in the Rajya Sabha from June 2010 to May 2012. He was inducted into the Union Council of Ministers as a Minister of State for Agriculture and Farmers Welfare and Parliamentary Affairs on 5 July 2016. Positions held 1984–86 Member, the G.S. Dillon Committee constituted by Government of India for providing relief and rehabilitation to the victims of the November 1984 riots in the country 1986–92 Member, Consultative Committee for the Ministry of Science and Technology Member, General Council of the Indian School of Mines, Danbad 1987–88 Member, Select Committee on Medical Council Bill April 2000–2001 Member, Consultative Committee for the Ministry of Agriculture September 2000–August 2004 Member, Committee on Finance 2001 Member, Consultative Committee for the Ministry of Information Technology August 2001–April 2006 and June 2006 Onwards Member, Business Advisory Committee January 2002 to February 2004 Member, Consultative Committee for the Ministry of Communications and Information Technology August 2002 August 2004 Member, Committee on Information Technology January 2003 to July 2004 Member, Committee of Privileges August 2004 to April 2006 and May 2006 Onwards Member, Committee on Home Affairs August 2004 to April 2006 and June 2006 Onwards Member, House Committee September 2004 to October 2007 Member, National Monitoring Committee for Minorities Education October 2004 to 2006 Member, Consultative Committee for the Ministry of Finance June 2006 to September 2006 Member, Committee on Rules September 2006 Onwards Member, Committee of Privileges April 2007 Onwards Convener, Sub-Committee on Civil Defense and Rehabilitation of J&K Migrants of the Committee on Home Affairs September 2007 Onwards Member, Committee on Finance and Member, Consultative Committee for the Ministry of Communications and Information Technology 
Topic speeches and other contributions in international forums 1989 attended the United Nations High Commission for Refugees UNHCR Human Rights Conference in Geneva, Switzerland as alternate leader of the Indian delegation, speech transcripts from the conference, violation of human rights in the occupied Arab territories including Palestine speech transcript right to development speech transcript human rights and fundamental freedoms speech transcript torture and enforced disappearances speech transcript report of sub Commission Speech Transcript Freedom of Religion Speech Transcript 2002 attended the United Nations General Assembly in New York, USA as a delegate. Speech transcripts from the conference, promotion and protection of the rights of children Speech Transcript Social Development including questions relating to the world Speech Transcript Gender Equality, Development and Peace for the 21st Century Speech Transcript 2002 attended the International Parliamentarians Association for Information Technology IPA IT I conference in Seoul, Korea as chair of the steering committee and moderated over theme 2. Joint Communique 2002 attended the Commonwealth Parliamentary Association conference in Windhoek, Namibia as leader of the Indian delegation. Speech Transcript 2008 attended the International Parliamentarians Association for Information Technology IPAIT V conference in Sofia, Bulgaria as vice president of IPAIT. Joint Communique 2010 IPU, I served as reporter in the first Standing Committee on Peace and International Security in the 109th Assembly of IPU in Geneva, E served as Vice President of the Standing Committee on Democracy and Human Rights in the 122nd IPU Assembly in Bangkok, Thailand, 2012 April, farewell speech in the Raja Sabha upon his retirement. S. S. Aluwalia's farewell speech on YouTube. Topic. Joint Parliamentary Committees JPC. August 1992 Member of Joint Parliamentary Committee to inquire into irregularities in securities and banking transactions April 2001 Member of Joint Parliamentary Committee on Stock Market Scam and Matters Relating Thereto August 2003 Member of Joint Parliamentary Committee on Pesticide Residues in Food Products and Safety Standards for Soft Drinks, Fruit Juices and Other Beverages JPC on Pesticide Residue in Soft Drinks Report on Pesticide Residue in Soft Drinks March 2011 Member of Joint Parliamentary Committee to Probe the Irregular Allocation of 2G Spectrum June 2015 Chairman, Joint Committee of Parliament to look into provisions of Land Acquisition Amendment Bill 2015. 